Hey loves and thanks for tuning back in to Channel XOX. So I got some juice and tea and some squeeze, okay? I'm gonna tell you guys how I basically met my older brother after 20 years. Okay. So right now I'm 22. I've known my brother for two years, okay? And I couldn't ask for a better older brother. Like he's great, he's awesome, and I love you, Courtney, if you're watching this. But before I get into the juicy tea and squeeze, you know what you guys need to do? Subscribe. That's what you need to do. And hit that bell so you can get all my notifications when I upload a video. Thank you guys so much. And give me a thumbs up on this video so I can continue doing more. Okay, now on to the tea. So... I'm pretty sure you guys got an idea why I have not met my older brother after 20 years. And if you don't, then I'm just going to tell you. My mom and my dad, um, they met. And when my mom met my dad, he already had children. So, okay. So, he, I had, he already had like four kids at the time. Which is a lot. But, hey, you can't judge people. You know, she fell in love. Whatever. So, then um my dad would always have pictures of my older siblings and stuff and i probably met them maybe once or twice maybe but i don't remember because they didn't come frequently in my life i don't know what happened in the crossfires maybe baby mama drama i don't know but all i know is 20 when i was 20 years old i got a friend request from a boy named courtney and I looked at the name like, hmm, excuse me. So I just accepted it. And then I looked at it and I, I clicked the profile and I'm like, oh my God, this is but an image of my father. So I'm in, I'm running through my house and I'm like, oh my God, ma, look, he got Courtney. So she's like, oh my God, he got so big. Da, da, da. And I'm showing my sisters because they really... If I didn't know him, you would know they really didn't know him. So they were like, oh my God, it's so nice to finally see one of our siblings. Da, 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 da. So we were just making, everybody was making plans so we can all see each other. We'll probably go out to eat at Pizza Hut or something, like get some Pizza Hut. I'm talking about go to eat at Pizza Hut. Go out to eat at like Giordano's or something like that. And we just get to know each other because he had his two siblings and then I had my three siblings. So it was just going to be like a family reunion, basically. A sibling reunion, okay? But that didn't even really get to happen. Because <laughs> it just was like, it was like he was going through things and then we were going through things and it just didn't get to happen. So a month goes by and me and my friends decide we want to go to the store named Foreman Mills. So we go to the store, we're looking around, blah, blah, blah. I'm just fake shopping or whatever, knowing I ain't buying nothing. So I get a tap on the back and I'm like, what girl? Da, da, da. And I sat around and I see my brother. Boy, what are you doing here? I was like, come here, come here, come here, big brother. And he just like, it's so good to see you. It's finally good to meet you. He just all cool and I'm all empty and stuff like, oh my God. <laughs> like I really love family. So when I finally got to meet him, it was just like, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. And so basically we just talked a little bit. He was shopping, he doing some house shopping with him and his girlfriend. So I basically was like, um, we definitely need to link up. So we did end up linking up after that after that um occasion and we basically me and him just click he like he's just so laid back and chill but more of the story is that if you have family if you think you have family if you don't think you have family just do a little searching because social media is a great platform to find family that hasn't found you yet or are looking for you or whatever the case may be like Everybody should know their family. Like I said, my papa was a Rolling Stone. So I could just be walking down the street and walking past my sibling and not even know it. Luckily for my brother, he looked exactly like my dad. So I couldn't be like, whoa, stop touching me. You know, you get what I'm saying? I know y'all get what I'm saying. 
But anyway, that's all for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for the juice and tan or squeeze. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.